Hello and welcome to this brief introduction on how to use QSTAR for Blue Giga Access Service. When you originally have QSTAR installed onto a Blue Giga device, you simply access the management front end by firing up your web browser and typing in the IP address that's given. You'll then be presented with this screen. As you can see, it's user friendly and very simple. If you navigate to this tab, the campaign manager, here you can create your Bluetooth marketing campaigns. If you go to navigate to uh, campaign statistics, you can see log files and more details about how the campaign is performing. Also, on the start page, you can see we have a quick campaign summary in, in the form of a pie chart and a system memory summary, which will actually tell you how much disk space is being used on the device. You'll receive a warning when it reaches 85% full to be able to delete log files to stop the device from filling up. We also have some shortcut navigation to be able to get to the various areas on the system as quickly as you would like. On Hustar Plus, you will also have the Advert Studio tab which becomes available. In here, you have content creation tools from business card creators, calendar entries, to animated gift creators. So the whole system in Hustar Plus becomes self-contained. If we select the campaign manager here, you can see that you can edit your Bluetooth marketing campaign. Simply by typing in the Bluetooth name here, you can change your Bluetooth friendly name just by typing it in. And then you upload either one or two files from your computer to be able to send out. Here you can see Bluetooth test is being sent out with the name Hutouch. We then preview our campaign to make sure that everything is we want it to be. Yes, the campaign name is Hutouch and we want it to send out a Bluetooth image. Click on approve and activate and then the system will reprogram the Blue Giga unit with this new campaign. As you can see here, the name is now Hutouch and the campaign has been updated. We can monitor the progress of any campaign by selecting campaign statistics. And here you can see there's a breakdown summary of how our campaign is currently working. So we've had 12.5% of all interactions were accepted, another 12.5% declined, and the rest were retried. We can also see that that really means that there was one accept, one retry, and one decline. It's a really simple way of being able to understand how Bluetooth marketing works. Once we're happy with our campaign, we can simply delete the stats log file here, and delete, and the campaign logs are cleared. When we go back home, we see that there are no log files currently available until we restart the campaign. By clicking on Advert Studio, you can see that the animated GIF creator appears. Here you're able to create an advert of various sizes depending on your phone. Give the file a name. We can then change the background color or the text color. Or we could upload an image from the computer. It's then rendered to the size and dimensions of the screen that you're working with. And then we could choose a Choose a font and color, and we can superimpose text over here. Like so. Preview the text that we've created. We can change the location of where that text will appear on the image. We can see how long we would like the frame to last for, how many seconds. Then when we're happy with this, we can skip to the next frame and we can add frame after frame and create an advert. Other tools in the Advert Creator Studio are Business Card Creator. Here you can see that simply you would type in the details of your business, um, loading an image, any type of uh, card that you would like. Often this is sent as the second file at the same time on a Bluetooth marketing campaign. So you can send your animated GIF, which we looked at earlier, as well as your business card, so that you can insert your contact details into the contacts directory of a mobile phone. Another useful tool is the calendar creator tool. Here you can have an appointment at a certain location. You can set your time and your dates of the event here. 
description. And a reminder that will actually send a reminder, a calendar reminder, on the user's phone when they accept this. The benefit of this is that you can send out an advert and also insert a time slot. So you may have an animated GIF, but then you're also able to remind people of your seminar through a calendar entry on their phone. As you can see, the QStart and QStart Plus packages are really straightforward to use, designed about user experience, making sure that Bluetooth marketing is available to all people without the requirement of a technical understanding. With QStart Plus and the advert and content creator, you can manage your entire campaign from this simple Blue Giga device. If you'd like to find out some more information, simply visit www.hutouch.com. Thank you.